We've all seen them, and most of us have probably gotten one or two. Yes, I have. I've gotten many tickets. I know a lot of my friends who have gotten a lot of them, and they're actually getting consequences because they're getting so many of them. So to make sure that parking in the Midtown area remains free on the weekends, the Public Works Department is asking City Council to accept some changes. Based on, you know, wanting to work with downtown and be, you know, this greater downtown region, we want to be consistent with what their hours are. Back when Midtown Crossing was being built, developers thought charging people on the weekends would help generate more customer turnover. But when more and more people started to get tickets on the weekends, instead of a turnover rate, the customers just weren't coming at all. They asked us why did we get a ticket here at Midtown Crossing and I didn't get a ticket downtown. So really it was back to that confusion of why aren't you the same as downtown. So last year City Council was asked to pass an ordinance that allowed free parking on the weekends since the rest of the city's meters are only enforced on the weekdays. Now they're being asked to extend that ordinance which expires July 1st. It's kind of nice to be able to drive in and not have to put a dime in the meter or worry about if you're in a play whether or not you've got to go back and plug the meter. It would kind of make you not want to come down here as much. It's a little restricted because not everybody can have as freedom to go wherever they want on the weekends and to pay extra just to park somewhere is really unfair. Scold says that people shouldn't worry because she feels confident that council will keep the citywide plan of free parking on the weekends. Clark Young, Fox 42 News.